you're welcome to my channel in this tutorial we are told that using the angles of 45 degree and 60 degree set square as basis construct the following angles in angles 22 and a half degree by bisection now this is what we call the set square this is the 60 degree and 30 degree set square why this is just the 45 degree set square now we want to construct angle 22 and a half degree the first thing you do you need to draw your horizontal line let's say this way at any given length you can see that we'll call it we'll call this point point a and what and point b that is the first thing you are going to do now the second thing you are going to do since we are told 22 and a half is that 22 and a half is gotten from um 45 degree right so i am going to take my 45 degree set square when it is placed this way any of the inclined axis here is what 45 degree and i'm going to move it until i get to the point that i want it to be so point a right and i'm going to now draw an a line this way i'll use faint line why am i using faint line because i'm not looking for 45 i'm looking for what for 22 and a half now if i bisect 45 right it is going to give us 22 and a half so when i place it here my compass at this point here i'm going to draw i'll cut this side this way just draw an arc this way better that way right so where the arc intersects a b i'll call it a prime and where the arc intersects this incline here i'll call it b prime you can see that now the next thing i'm going to do is at any given radius i'll place my compass at a prime i will strike an arc i'll see place it at b prime i will strike another arc so where they meet they meet at this point let me call it point c so i'm going to draw a line from point a through point c right and i'm going to be having this this way so this time i'm going to thicken it since that is what i'm looking for so i'm going to thicken it this way now taking it this way this will now give me 22 and a half so the angle between this and this right is given as what 22 and a half or you call it 22.5 any of them 22 and a half degree this is how you construct 22 and a half degree and in some cases you might be told to just use only your compass to construct right now let's see if i'm to use my compass to construct what will i have so i'm going to repeat the same thing here just like i drew my ab i'm going to draw another one again this way a b right so this is point a and what and point b i am going to extend a this way you can see that so at the point a here i will take my compass i'm going to place it at point a and i will draw a semicircle this way now where the semicircle intersect the axis a b i'll call it to be my a prime i'll call it to be what my a prime prime now with my compass at any given radius i'll place it at a prime prime right i will strike an arc i'll place it at a prime i'll strike an arc so let's see where it cuts it's called point c now i'll draw a line that will pass through point c from point a this way now i will not take in it because i am not looking for this now what angle is this this is called angle 90 degree 
but I don't need 90. What I'm actually looking for is 45. Now we know that the word bisect means divide, right? So if I want to divide 90, I'll have 45. So where A prime prime cuts the vertical axis, I'm going to call it A prime prime prime, right? Now I'll place it at A prime prime this way. Get any radius. I'll strike another arc this way. And I'll place it at A prime 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 this way. And I'll strike another arc. So where they meet here, I'm going to call it point D. I'll draw a line through point A to pass through point D this way. You can see that. Now, I don't need this. Since I bisect A, I, I bisect A prime 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 and A prime prime, I'm having 45 degrees. So it means that from this uh, from this inclined line to this point here is 45 degree, right? But what I'm actually looking for is what? It's 22 and a half. Now this is A prime prime. So this point where it intersects, let me call it A I V right let me put it that way now between these two points i'm going to bisect it again so if i place it at a prime prime here i'll check and add this is what i have i'll place it at i a i v i'll check another arc let's say it is meeting at this point point e right and i'm going to take my meter rule to pass through point e so where it passes through point e i can take in it because I know fully well that that angle between this angle here and here is given as what? 22 and a half degree. Right? So this is two different things. This is when you are constructing just with your compass. And this is when you are using your set square as your basis. Right? So we can easily confirm this if we are correct. Just to just show you that we are more on track than what you can imagine so let's confirm that if i place it this way my protractor here if i place my protractor here you can see what we have here this is um this is zero this is zero this is 10 this is 20 right 21 22 and a half at this angle here the same thing here too the same thing is being applied here if I place it this way, you discover that this is 0, 10, 20, 21, 22, 22 and a half. You can see that? So this is what we have here. I'm just showing you for the benefit of what? Of knowledge. So if you have found this video helpful, please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share the video. Thanks for watching.